Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I've got some really, really exciting news and that is that a brand new range of products has launched in Boots today and the brand I'm talking about is called Farmology. So this is the brand new brand called Farmology which is super exciting and this is a signed note from the owner called Joanna. It says, enjoy best wishes Joanna. And I just absolutely love the logo, like it's so pretty. I've actually had to keep this top secret for about two months. I couldn't tell anybody about the brand and I was dying to just put on Instagram um, and especially on here talk about like the products and I couldn't. So at least today I can tell you all what's been going on. So if you're new here then I'd really appreciate it if you could click subscribe and let's get on with the video. So I'm just going to give you a little bit of backstory to this. So I think some of you might have already seen my video on the review of the Child's Farm Moisturiser, which is this one, the Baby Moisturiser, and it really helped my eczema. So I uploaded that video to my YouTube channel, and I wasn't even expecting it to get many views. I just thought it'd be really useful for those who had eczema like me, if they typed in into YouTube, they might be able to find a review um, of somebody who's tried it and really liked it. So I uploaded that about three months ago, and then one of the evenings about a month ago, I was just sitting on my phone on Instagram and I had a message from the official Child's Farm Instagram and they told me that a colleague of theirs found my video and watched it and really liked it and they asked me to become their brand ambassador for Child's Farm. I was so, so excited about that because I was a Soap and Glory ambassador for two years while I was at uni and I just like love trying new products and reviewing them. But I jumped at the chance, I was like, oh my God, I'd absolutely love to be your ambassador for Child's Farm. Um, but all of their products are specifically, well not specifically, but they're aimed at children. So I didn't really care about that. I was just like, it's really worked for me and it's a brand I'd love to represent. And then it was about three weeks later, I had an email come through to say they were actually launching a brand new range that was top secret called Farmology. And it's under the name Child's Farm, but it's aimed at adults instead. So um, I was like enrolled to try out their products for two weeks. So in lockdown for two weeks, I've been trying out their products and that was constantly throughout the 14 days. So I didn't use any other moisturizers or body washes in that time and then I had to give feedback through questionnaire. So these are the products in the new Farmology range. I also have two more products but I don't have enough hands. Um, but as you can see at first impressions, it's so colourful. And these are the products that I was sent to try out and as soon as I opened the box I just internally screamed um, because I've never seen products like this for eczema and sensitive skin. A lot of the products that are already in Boots and Superdrug for eczema are quite just like plain, like just white, with hardly any colour to them at all. And it always just feels very boring, like when I'm searching for products, it's cruelty free, which I think is so, so important. I always try to buy cruelty free makeup and moisturising products because I'm a huge animal lover and I always have been. But Farmology is completely cruelty free. Um, it's also suitable for vegans as well. And also I noticed when I was showering, because it, when it's on the shelf, I start reading the bottle. Um, it says that bottles for the body washes are recycled ocean bound plastic. This product is made from recyclable material. The bottle says this bottle is made of 100% recycled ocean bound plastic collected from rivers and coastal areas. It's 100% recyclable as well. So it's not gonna damage the environment. We were actually sent indicative products. so these are tester products that will look slightly different to the ones in store. So the first product I'm going to talk to you about is the Pharmology Pink Grapefruit Hand Cream and I absolutely love this hand cream so much. It's actually one of my favourite hand creams I've ever used um, and I'm not just saying that either. I really like the scent of it, it's really fresh and it just sinks in so easy to the skin. A lot of the time, like with hand cream, I don't know why, but I always feel like it's a little bit of a chore to put on. I just can never be bothered because I put it on and then my hands are greasy for like a good 10 minutes. I just try to avoid it sometimes. I just try and put it on at night times and things when I'm not gonna be touching things. But this hand cream, it just sinks in so quickly. Like, my hands feel really good and my hands aren't greasy either. It just has such a fresh scent as well. Like, it's, it's really nice for summer. So the next product I'm going to be talking about is a product that I 
have absolutely loved throughout the trial and that is the Farmology Coconut Body Oil and I've actually never normally used body oil. I don't know, it's just not something that I'll usually pick up. I'll usually just tend to go for a moisturiser instead. This is to put on after the shower and it also can be used for uh, massages as well, like a massage oil. So it's great that it's a two in one. And I've absolutely been loving this product. It's just the way my skin feels after I've used it is unbelievable. Because if you have eczema or dry skin, especially in the winter, do you know when you've got like lots of dry patches? When I put this on and massage it in and I feel my arm afterwards, I can't feel any dry patches anymore. It just feels like silky smooth pretty much like velvet, like my skin literally feels like, you know when you shave your legs and it's that smooth feel, It my skin literally feels like that, it just feels so moisturising, it's so absorbing as well, so I've been opting for this after the shower all the time. The next thing that I'm going to talk about is the unfragranced moisturiser, and Pharmology have, as far as I know, three different scents, so one's unscented, well, that isn't really classed as a scent, but you know what I mean. Um, one's pink grapefruit and one's coconut. But I think it's brilliant that they do scented and unscented because a lot of the time in the winter, if my eczema gets a little bit bad, like very itchy and dry, I don't really tend to want to put things that have a lot of fragrance in because I just feel like it adds to the itchiness and dryness. This is a moisturiser. It doesn't actually specify what it's for. It doesn't say it's a particular body moisturiser or anything. So I've actually been using this everywhere. So all over my body and also on my face as well. And I've had no issues with it like breaking me out in spots or anything. And also if this was fragranced, I wouldn't be tempted to put it on my face. So next I'm gonna be talking about the body washes. So these are the two body washes that I received. So one's scented pink grapefruit and the other one is unfragranced. And again, I think it's brilliant that they do an unscented and scented range because you can opt for whatever you're feeling. Um, in the summer, because now it is summer, <laughs> I have been using the pink grapefruit a lot in the shower. I think this is like half full now. It feels quite empty. I haven't been using this one as much because I really like the scent of this. But I do think in the winter I'll be opting for this one. Again, when I get quite itchy and uncomfortable with my skin. These lather in the shower so nicely as well. I haven't been using a body buffer, I've just been using my hands and lathering it in and it creates like a really nice lather. I always feel like it moisturises my skin as well as clean it. Um, I've never had any issue with having it irritating any areas of my skin, especially my eczema, so I just can't recommend these enough. And finally, this is the Farmology Pink Grapefruit Bath Soak and I've really been liking this. So you just pour this under warm running water in the shower, Ugh, in the bath. It smells just like the body wash and the hand cream. <laughs> I haven't been having that many baths because it's been really hot. I think today it's like 31 degrees, so I've just been having quick showers. But I have been using this for foot spas and things, put it in a basin of water and soak in my feet. It's been really soothing for my feet and I just really like this. And Definitely when it starts to get colder, I'll be using this a lot more. Thank you so much for watching this video. They are launching in Boots, so go and check it out on the Boots website. And you might see more videos with Farmology featuring in my videos, so subscribe if you want to see those. And thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next week. Bye!